now underway. Valencia coach Rafael Benitez is the clear favourite with the bookies. Alan Kerbishley is also among the front runners and Charlton admit they can't guarantee he'll be at the Valley next season. The speculation increased about a possible move to Merseyside for their manager. Charlton decided to get their retaliation in first. In the clearest possible terms, the club's chief executive sent out a warning shot not just to Liverpool, but to any other club which might be looking to poach the man who steered them to an impressive seventh place in the table. As soon as somebody gets the sack, then obviously it seems to be Alan Kerbishley is one of the first names they turn to. The situation is that Alan signed a new three-year contract at the beginning of the year. He's happy here, he's got the biggest transfer budget any child manager's ever had, so why would he want to leave? He's also enjoyed 13 years of progress with Charlton in a relatively pressure-free environment, a crucial factor in the campaign to keep him at the Valley. These are good times at Charlton and, you know, to walk away from that into a situation where there's far more pressure, you know, there will be instant success demanded at a club like Liverpool. You know, we're hopeful that Alan will see that um, he can fulfil his objectives with us here. They're hopeful, but Varney was reluctant to confirm or deny that his manager's contract includes release clauses to allow him to speak with a handful of the Premiership's top clubs. Well, I don't think it's right to talk about contracts because obviously they're a private matter uh, between Alan and us, and I know there's been a lot of speculation about that in, in the press, but you're right. Alan has a great relationship with the chairman, Richard Murray, and the board of directors, and I repeat, he has the freedom to run the football side of this club in the way that he wants to. Only Manchester United have a more stable managerial history in the Premiership. Charlton are well used to dealing with speculation about their man, whether real or imaginary. Peter Staunton, Sky Sports.